One thing I'm asked a lot on social media by people is, can you train when you're injured and how to train and how to stay motivated? The motivation part is, is another video. I've actually used a link probably up there to watch the video I did before um, all about it. But I want to talk a little bit about training while injured. It's actually one of the easiest things in the world. Now I've had surgery on my ankle. Uh, I'm not allowed to do anything on it at the moment, apart from light rehab. So you'll see in the video, seated battle ropes, great. Works your heart, works your upper body. Uh, you know, if you've got a fat burning, if you want to stay conditioned, that will help. Obviously, uh, a lot of MMA fighters use um, battle ropes to train their upper body in terms of dealing with um, fatigue, as well as seated versa climber. Now, seated versa climber is hanging. You know, it's one of the worst bits of kit. Uh, it's the best bit of kit, one of the worst bits of kit in terms of uh, it hurting you. It's, um, <clears throat> you know, especially when you're doing standing, it's pretty rank. Seated is even worse. Um, so I ground out, I climbed the Eiffel Tower, obviously not in real life. Um, but all those little bits and pieces can be adjusted. All you need to do is get yourself a box. You can do seated weights on the box. If you've got lower limb injury, if you've got an upper body injury, you could obviously do, do body weight work. You can do uh, leg press. You can do leg extension. You can do hamstring curl. Basically, just avoid the area. So with me, ankle, I do everything seated. I could do clean to press seated. I could do whatever you want to do. So there's not really an excuse not to train. You just got to think and just adapt exercises. Um, so those of you who message me, hopefully that answers your question.